something feels nice. Little channel. We'll get back with some more. Hey guys, I, I was just casting a fluke by shore and I got a nice walleye. some nice fish right there so we'll get back to you guys with more fish and we're gonna get a picture of this go hey guys welcome back that, I just dropped my neck collar down here I got something hooked up I don't know what it is oh sheep head nice fish stay tuned This is nice. Oh, a little walleye. Sweet. Oh, man. I'm so glad. We haven't, other than that one that Grant got, it's been a couple years. I don't know. One year. There he is. Stay tuned. Hey guys, so right now I'm just going to explain to you what we're using and what we're doing. So, Hunter right there. Just a slip sinker rig with two snelled hooks and a full night crawler. It's been working. And I'm using uh, water gremlin weights uh, as he is. And I'm just going to set up a slip sinker rig too with just one hook. So, meet us back here after these messages. Look at me. Look at me. Hey guys, got one going now. Ooh, what could this be? Super close to shore, just right out. A walleye again. That's three on the day. Combined, me and my brother. So, this one's hooked right in the upper lip. Get him unhooked. Whoa, so, stay tuned, guys. Oh, sorry. That's fine. Not too far off from shore. Reeling in. As I was filming my brother get that other walleye. Boom. Probably 19 incher. Gold. We'll get a measurement and get a picture. A walleye here. Yes, I do. About, uh, I'd say 15 inch fish. Nice. Got him with that back hook. You can just tell how it's a walleye when they stay down and those big head shakes. Nice fish. We'll get the picture and hopefully some more. Let's go. I don't know what I hooked in into. If it's a walleye, it's close to 25. Holy cow. Gotta take it slow with light line. Oh man. Holy! Oh, just what I said. Big. Voila. Oh man, that's 25. No, no, no. Come on, Grant, don't break. Walleye, holy cow. I don't know, he's probably about 20. Stay tuned. Go. Hey, here's the fish. I over exaggerated, he's 20 inches, 2 pounds, 11 ounces. Still, still, look at that stomach. Really fat, nice river walleye. I'll get a leash right now. Right away. Oh, that's stuck in the 
Wow, stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back. This is my sixth walleye of the day. All on this slip sinker rig with two snow. And it's important to have the two hooks because either the worm will fly off when you cast it or else you'll miss the fish that will short strike it. Probably another 17 inch fish. Go. Another walleye, I think, staying down. It's biting really hard. It's so close. Boom, oh, another walleye. Here's the tricky part. Oh, he's barely hooked. Man, fishing on these rocks is just hard to deal with. Yeah, he's barely hooked. Six, seven, that might be six. Oh, look at that. Hook fell right out. Another nice walleye. In fact, this is like my ninth walleye. Oh, this feels nice. Yeah. I don't, this hardly ever happens. I don't know why they're just schooled up here. For some place in Canada. Ah, oh, it broke. Oh no, it came off. Shoot. Stay tuned. Hey guys, um, so right here we're gonna end the segment. We had a pretty good show today. We caught quite a quite a good quantity of fish. Really nice walleye. Um, we also caught um a lot of sheephead, but we didn't feel that that was worth our time to film. <coughs> Excuse me, because they're rough fish. And, uh, those walleyes, the Mississippi down here in Pool 2, they have a closed, uh, slot, so you can't keep any. And the mercury, and we wouldn't have keep, kept them anyways, because the mercury levels are so high. So, thanks for watching this episode of Rips and Whips. Meet us back here for the next episode. See you guys next time. Days in a lazy boy in a mansion on a hill. Or catch a fast train straight to New Orleans or a slow ship down to Cozumel. I could waste away my spare time watching football with my friends. But I'd rather get my rod and reel and go fishing when I can. I wanna go fishing. Cause it takes my stress away I wanna go fishing Try and cast my blues away I wanna go fishing I don't want to watch the clock I wanna go fishing I don't ever want to stop Now, a special thanks to HG Bait Co. and also Water Gremlin. For all your line weight needs, he's only the best, Water Gremlin. Thanks for watching this episode of Rips and Whips. See you guys next time.